Hey everyone, Rory is here, back with Half-Life. Now, we just stopped uh, from the previous episode, um, and we got just arrived at the point where we got the bee, or the hive hand, or the hornet gun, or the bee gun, or whatever you want to call it, and um, we're about to see some really cool military versus alien stuff. So, yeah. <laughs> I would use the hive hand, but it's actually kind of crap. So, I'm going to use this instead. I know it's risky. I might end up killing the- killing him. But, I have other options which are much more effective. Oh god. Stay away from the grenade, dude. Oh. Okay, load- load level again. Okay, so he survived, yay! <laughs> I managed to save him. Ah, oh, I've lost all my armor. Let's get the hell out of here. We can bring this guy with us for a little bit, but then he gets tra he um I believe he can't move on after a certain while, certain time. So actually no, I am gonna leave Go him here. He's him. safe here. <laughs> You're safe here. Uh reload this. And then quick save it. I believe there is No? Oh, I thought this was one that had a turret in it. There's a few trucks that have turrets in the back. Yeah, there's some crazy explosions and stuff happening. But if I'm not mistaken, it's not until you go up there that you see the really cool stuff. We might just go up there, have a look at it, and then load again because it's just a really cool scene. Yeah, you see this thing. One of those things, which is those alien crafts that drop. <laughs> ah. Okay, I'm gonna load. So what you what I don't know why I always loved that scene when I was younger. I mean I do know why, but it's it seems so lackluster now by by modern standards. You just like pop your head out. One of these one of these alien I don't even know what these are called, but they're like little saucers. They drop off some... They drop off a bunch of aliens and then the military immediately swoops in and kills all of them with the, with the jet. And then drops a tank, or you know, drives the tank through the, through the, um, the wall there. Okay, this is a quite a challenging... Ow. Okay, let's try that again. Let's not immediately- oh god. Let's not immediately die. <laughs> okay, uh... Oh god. Screw you, buddy. Uh, no, I'm not happy with that. I'm not happy. Um... I need to get something that will do the damage. You know what? I'm gonna go with this. Okay, now I'm gonna quick save it because I knew he was coming. Okay, that's all right. I'm okay with that. Okay, cool. I got a lot of stuff there. Cool. I believe it's just the two military guys, and then there's the tank. Um, and so this is where it gets a little tricky. Now, you, with cool thing with a rocket is you can have the red dot sight on, which makes it home in. But if you right click, you can turn that off, which is super useful for times like this. Because you can fire it off, and then quickly hide, so that it will actually go in the, the right direction. Now, this thing's actually a lot more powerful than I give it credit for. Or that anyone gives it credit for. See? <laughs> it blew up the tank. If you let it charge up, it does tremendous damage, but it's very direct damage. Um, I have no more of that ammo. I'm gonna get, to the, get the revolver out. Probably could get through there without destroying it, but to run along here, you're prone to getting shot. So it's so much nicer, so much easier if you just blow it up. Okay. Whew. So I love that bit, but it's very challenging. So yeah, there's a lot of bombing, a lot of like aerial bombing, which is I'm, I imagine how a how a real government would handle an alien invasion. Just airstrikes constantly. <laughs> I like it because of 
knowing the context of the aftermath of this says yeah, it, it's very poignant to me because these aliens are pretty crazy and they're pretty hard to deal with but they're just an a strange alien force you know they're not like they're not like humans in that they have they don't have a a logical a hierarchy of people they haven't got like a logical hierarchy of people doing the the military strategies and stuff like that they're just dropping people in dropping aliens in hoping that the aliens can kill something Ooh, bright yeah hoping that the aliens can kill something do something you know Nilanth is just dropping aliens in really early. and it's already a challenge for us to to hold them back hold the forces back and so knowing that in Half-Life 2 essentially what happens now is the the aliens the aliens have are using a rift between Earth and Zen or our our realm and Zen uh, to tr transport their people. Essentially, the combine utilize that same rift uh, and come through from Zen because they've managed to get to Zen and then they just like hop over from Zen to our our realm and they f mess shit up. <laughs> Roger that. Let's run like hell. Okay, open this up, please. Yeah, he survived, so... This is the ultimate room. <laughs> Basically, it's just an all-weapons room. A room full of ammunition. <laughs> yeah. I, I believe there is there are grenades for this. But you don't get them just by running alongside, I think. I think. Unless I'm wrong. I might be wrong. Ah, oh, lame. One of my favorite ammo is not here. <laughs> no. I don't remember it not being here. That's quite surprising. So yeah, it's just a room full of ammo. Just just a little ammo room. And it's purely here for the fact that, uh, you know, I, I think it's here because of the idea that, like, you, you probably used a lot of your ammunition in the previous sections. So yeah, they just give you all, as much ammo as they can, back to you. They didn't give me full uranium, though. Or snarks. But snarks makes sense. Uh, yeah. Oh, and they didn't even give me that much freaking revolver ammo either. All good. Yeah, this guy can easily die if the soldiers come upstairs and kill him. And so, yeah, you gotta get them quick. Avoid letting him die. Okay. So, I believe this is what I'm gonna do. Eh. Yep. Oh, <laughs> okay, this time, this time. Eh, damn right. Yeah, I don't like being able to hear those noises. Those noises are the noises that the grunts make. The military are much quieter, and I know that they're here, but I can't hear them. Oh, that startled me. like Dirty Harry or an ex some sort of executioner I just like hover out over the edges and murder god damn it okay well they've discovered I'm here they've gone now. If you do this stealthily, you can, um... Oh, freaking hell. That was a really bad... Oh, man. A really bad effort. <laughs> I don't even think they're all dead. Um... I like this gun because you can just do a quick startled. Yeah, we can just loop back around here. So now we've got a little opening. Um, with this with this uh, gorse gun, you can just do sort of like startled 
rapid, really heavy damage. Damn it, I, right, I hopped right down, so I... God dang it. <laughs> this has not been my day for this game. It's been, I've been all over the place with how well I'm doing. Oh, that was close. <laughs> okay, this bit is really frustrating. Oh, I have some of this now. Okay, let's just go for it. Ah! Quickly! Ah! Come on, hit him. Yeah. Basically, you get quickly run to this and shoot the place up. The problem is, is that military do arrive. And you need to get past them. Okay, quickly, quickly. While they're... No! God damn it! I just killed myself. Ah, dear. Okay, I'm gonna ignore these guys and I'm just gonna run for it. <laughs> okay, let's try that again. I'm just gonna keep shooting this wall for a bit. Oh god. Okay, I think he died. I think he immediately died. Okay. Um, I should just go. Run! <laughs> Run for it! Ah! Before military arrive. Okay. Oh god, this but No, I already freaking started it! Oh. This is like a like a space invaders. Oh, it's so loud. I'm probably going to tone that right down. It's like a bad space invaders. <laughs> uh mini game. I knew he was there and I was like, I bet it's not going to continue until he dies. I think it also tries to trick you by um, pretending that it stops and just like randomly spawning one after some time. Nope, okay. If one spawns now, I'm gonna be annoyed. <laughs> Some weird as alien stuff growing, including this thing, which I <laughs> neglected to point out. Um, some kind of crazy spore or like plant thing that causes, that always makes things bounce, you know, it pushes you. Um, quick save it. What am I gonna use for this part? Maybe I'll use this. Okay, let's, let's do something. Let's let them kill each other first. That noise that sounds like, um, ladder, like a ladder, is actually the alien grunts. For some reason they make weird noises when they run. Damn it. Oh god, I fell down. Maybe that was a good thing. I avoided his shots. Eh. Sometimes weirdness happens with those things. It struggles to lift you off the ground sometimes. That got him. <laughs> it's like killing a cockroach with a nuke. <laughs> Total overkill. 
Eh. Alrighty. Eh. Okay, I don't actually need health. It's all good. Um, alrighty. What am I... Where am I going? In here, I see. Oh, it's this bit. Wait, no. Okay. This is t tough to, uh, do 100% correctly. <laughs> Even then, it didn't work. Okay, I'm gonna have to use grenades instead. Um, basically, there's like a, a little nest up there. Is that it? Is that it? No, there's another one. Ooh. You can try and sort of kill them. Oh, yes. Damn it. Okay, I think I think that's all of them. I, I'm amazed I managed to shoot them before they got to me. Basically, yeah, there's this little nest of snarks in here. And they're, uh, this is like a real nest. This is what the nests actually look like. Um, is this the part I'm thinking of? It is. Run. Damn, I didn't actually get to show you what that looks like. They basically shoot up the vent <laughs> and there's like whole, uh, holes appearing all over the place. Um, yeah, to me it just it comes across like an excuse that, that they have to hear you in this part. You have to break that bit. Damn it, I selected I selected another weapon and it wouldn't let me it wouldn't disappear. I could try and use this. That's dumb. It's quite dumb. Because of the fact that it only stores eight, it's very it's poor. It's a poor weapon. Um Any more of them? No, that's it. Sir, ah, uh, here, something. Yeah, <laughs> so nevertheless, that's that done. I believe now there's just a... Um, I don't quite remember how this works now. That's right. Basically, that door gets destroyed. <laughs> Yeah, I was waiting for that. <laughs> so I was like, why didn't the wall explode? It did, just then. If I'm not mistaken. Uh, no, it's that one that you press it and you go up. Okay. This is really tough to do without getting hurt. Although I'm not going for that, am I? I'm, I'm, I can throw some snarks through there. <laughs> The fact that they just died like that is a really good sign. Yeah, <laughs> I killed him without having to even look at them. Yeah, so this guy, he's one of these bastards that just immediately shoots a freaking grenade. So I remember several times going up and then immediately dying because getting hit by a grenade by him. But there's also another guy here. Um, I, I don't think he mans the gun. <laughs> you just like listen, <laughs> and if there's a this movement, you immediately just boom. <laughs> okay, okay. This is also a frustrating bit purely for the fact that it's it's cool. I like it a lot because of all the the war happening here. But it's easy to be caught up in the gunfire. No, <laughs> one more time, one more time. This is why I don't make much progress. I'm so busy frickin'. 
Oh, don't need any health. Oh, what the freaking hell. Once again, a poor, poor performance. Are you kidding me? Damn right. Why aren't they attacking? Aren't there, aren't there aliens around? I was gonna say, this is normally an alien soldier fight. God. Let's get out of here for a brief second. Let them fight it out. I feel like there's definitely aliens on the roof here. There's still aliens alive, why are they not doing anything? <sighs> the AI, man. Some AI is super cool, like there's some super super awesome AI. And then other AI is just absolute crap. <laughs> uh, says the guy who couldn't freaking write an AI to save himself. Actually, I did fairly well in my AI paper, but it was not like this kind of AI. <laughs> kidding me? Did he just take like six shots to kill? What the freaking hell? <sighs> okay. Um, I think I've got everything so I can hop down onto this place. Avoid hurting myself. Okay, let's get this out just for a change of pace. There are different God damn it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you don't come to me for the perfect let's play. You come for me to me for the random <laughs> <laughs> random noises. What do you, what do people come to me for? I don't know. I'm gonna work that out. <laughs> okay. Basically, I've got to get uh, one of the uh, security guys to come down and open this door for me. And to do that, I've got to get to him first. Yeah. Yeah. You actually hit the skybox when you do that jump and you fall down from the skybox onto... Yeah, it's weird. It's weird. Okay, this is one of these cinematic moments. Okay. I don't know how far you have to get into this pipe for it to happen. There we go. Uh, he throws a grenade in and he's, it's like... Uh. Instead of it being like a normal grenade, it does the whole fire thing. Fire down a tube thing. <laughs> um, a little bit weird. A little bit strange. Once again, I don't know how far you have to go before the door opens. Nope. Damn it, I missed him. <laughs> okay, okay, we won. <laughs> we won in the end. There's a soldier down here who's getting attacked by head crabs, which I think is really cool. doesn't know I'm here yet. <laughs> oh my god, he just immediately exploded. Oh my god, he just immediately, oh, oh god. He immediately exploded. <laughs> oh my god, that was funny. Oh god. Damn it, I fell down. It's okay, it's okay, there's health down here. 
I feel like there's also a freaking soldier down here. No? Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah. I was I was genuinely not expecting that. I was just thinking he would be like, because I just shot him with a normal shot, so I thought, oh, you're just a, like, Urgh. damn it! <laughs> uh, but then, like, he just he just exploded. He just freaking immediately exploded. <laughs> like I expect it from those shots, because I charged them up and they were super powerful. Because they're enough to like destroy tanks and stuff. They're they're a powerful shot. But it's when it's just like a... Okay, no, 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 no. <laughs> yeah. Like, I would expect it often from the right-click version of this gun. But... Stand back. Yeah, he tries to defend himself very slowly. Come on. Come with. Okay, I'm gonna quick save it because I don't know if guys respawn, or you know, new guys spawn to try and kill this guy. I need him. I actually, I actually need him. If he dies, uh, you can't exit this area. It's one of the few areas you actually just genuinely have to, unless you're sort of cheating or you know using um, okay. speed running tactics. Anyway. Uh, yeah, you you have to have him. I have energy weapons too. Dude, you shot me. You bastard. Okay, switch away from this weapon. I'm using too much of its ammo. And it shares ammo with the best gun in the game, which is such a, a freaking ammo hog. <laughs> He's doing the beep thing from his mouth. I love that. Okay, you stay there. Yeah, you stay there and... and Keep an eye out. Oh god. Ah! It's this bit. Ah! It's the Gargantua chase. And <laughs> I usually run so quickly, you know, I, I immediately try and run. So half the time I don't even see the Gargantua until I'm already up on the... Okay, now we could do this. Quick save it. Yeah. It's so easy to mess this up. Yeah. Okay, cool. Copy? Forget about They're abandoning the base. No. If you have any last bomb targets, mark them on the tactical map. Otherwise, get the hell out of there. Repeat, we are pulling out and commencing airstrikes. Give us targets or yeah. get below. Yeah. This is one of the ones you I don't think you can break here. Um I like that because it's actually utilized in, again, in um, Opposing Force. You actually see the guy who makes that call to try and, you know, abandon mission. Oh dear. Don't come over here. Stay right there. Oh god. Ah! I forget that he can run. He can freaking do that. It's not okay. It's not okay. It's BS. Oh, this is why I quick save it. Okay, so I've loaded back here. Any minute now, he'll probably break through here to try and attack me. Or maybe he's stuck. Maybe because I loaded, he doesn't know where I am and it's going to stay like this. Nope, there we go. 
Oh my god, why does it not hit where it's supposed to freaking hit? Okay. Um. So way over. Like way over there. Like that. And I'm gonna shoot it now. Damn it. Again. Again. No. The fact that they allowed him to be able to get up here is such BS. No. Not okay. Damn right. You piece of shit. <laughs> I know you can do it elsewhere. You know, you can do it by um, running. But I was not having it. that's how you're supposed to do it. You're supposed to break all the stuff over here. Break open the door. There we go. And then break... Because you've got to break three targets. Um, bring it in a bit. Yeah, there we are. Okay, not close enough. See, and that's the problem. Is if you don't get it close enough... Then, and you miss a target, then you're pretty, you're pretty screwed, because you just don't have the time. I'd rather kill the Gargantua and then just take my time with this. <laughs> yeah, so you break those three, and then you can hop over and get to your safety. And then you have more targets being bombed, and you run. <laughs> you run for your damn life. <laughs> Going underground is the best idea when there's an air raid. Yeah, basically there's this bit here where the floor is, the roof is falling out underneath everything and you just gotta get through. Yep. Basically, yeah, they're, they're going full out. Oh, I forgot about that. Oops. Oh well. <laughs> Screw it. This part's really quite tough. I might just sprint. This might be where I just take the coward's way out and run for it. What? No, 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 no. Okay, I'm gonna do what I originally said I was gonna do. Screw it. Nope. Not gonna work. Not gonna work. I thought this was a part that I could do that. Perhaps not. I don't have the frickin' machine gun grenades to do it. Damn it. I really wanna just sprint. Didn't mean to do that. Okay. Okay. Let's just go for it again. I dodged them! Oh my god, I dodged all of them! Did I- I didn't get all of them, that's okay. Ah! Ah! <laughs> go away. <laughs> I can't believe I just did that. I just made it through with only losing 30 health. <laughs> We're still not in a new chapter. I've been playing for freaking ages. Yeah, basically there's this bit. This chapter is so long. I would make a that's what she said joke, but that made no sense. God damn it. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's just keep going for a little bit, a little bit longer. It's gonna make it through these sewers. Oh, these give me flashbacks of the um, sewers and opposing force. God damn it. They do 10 damage when you have no armor. 
That's ridiculous. There's a freaking Itchy in there somewhere. I always just call them Itchies because uh, the full name is way too frustrating to, s to pronounce. Ow. Oh god. Ah. That bit's so dodgy. So sketch, as people would say now. Nowadays. <laughs> I'm not up with the lingo. <laughs> I'm an old man. You know what? Screw you, buddy. It's not what I meant to do. Okay, I don't know if there's another turret. No, there isn't. Okay. Okay, there's tons of rocket ammo. Perfect timing to use a rocket, right? Oh dear. I didn't, didn't even plan that either. Oh god. This is why they give you rockets. No, that's why they give you rockets. Ow! Damn right. <laughs> sure. I'll take that. I'll take the only 38 health. I feel like we're right near the end of the chapter. This is why I kept playing. I thought, I feel like we're pretty getting pretty close now. God damn it. God damn it. I hate it when there's the turrets just auto, uh, auto activate. <laughs> okay. I think that this is the end of the chapter, I believe. I'm just gonna reload. I believe this is the next chapter. I'm gonna just save it and have a look. Oh, that was actually two chapters, wasn't it? We were in surface tension then I was we were playing Forget About Freeman just then. And we're still in technically in Forget About Freeman. So okay. <laughs> but we're out of the like surface battle stuff. Well, there is still more surface battle stuff, to be fair. God, this game's every time I think about it, every time I replay this game, I remember just how damn long it is. It's actually there's actually way more to this game than I than I ever remember. But anyway, <laughs> I'm going to have to call it there. I've been recording. This is even a lo an even longer episode than the previous one. So this might be tra uh, tricky to edit all of it, actually, uh, for one day. But we'll see how it goes. Fingers crossed this comes out promptly. <laughs> if you like what you saw, hit like. If you want to see more from me, then subscribe. Tell me why it is that you subscribe to me. Just because I am trying to figure that out why people watch what I, what I do. Just because, I don't know, sometimes it's hard to remember why people are interested in your stuff anyway thank you so much for watching <laughs> thank you for putting up with me and as always